So today I want to talk a little bit about boundaries. What are they? Do you have them? Do you know how to apply them? And what is the myth that we can often fall victim to when we actually apply a, a boundary? So I start with the topic of values because for me, we don't really know what to put a boundary around if we don't actually check in with ourselves to say, okay, what's important in my life? What do I need in this relationship? What do I need in this transaction? What do I need to live a fulfilled and well life. So things like trust, honesty, respect, fun, money, compassion, empathy. There's a whole list of values out there um, that people do really aspire to have more of in their life. But then when they come to me often, um, they're not living to those values. And quite often in their relationships, be it personal or professional, they're with people that don't really align with their values or respect their values. But how can we put a boundary around something that we're not even aware of, that we're not even living by. So first step is check in what's your values. Second step, look at the people, the relationships, the scenarios around you and say, where am I getting to live my values? Where are my values showing up in my job? Where are my values showing up in my relationships with people, my friendships? Um, my personal relationships, whatever it may be, where are they showing up? Okay, and where are their issues? Okay, where what is causing me stress and what value, what value is being compromised? What am I allowing to be compromised? So, for example, you know, there could be a work situation with colleagues where, you know, you value respect or you value communication or you value um, uh, honesty. Um, and that person that you're interacting with, maybe they have a completely different set of values. Um, um, and maybe they don't show up in the world as communicative or honest um, and that really causes stress in your life. So there's two things that you can do have a conversation with the person and um, if that doesn't actually uh, bring any change then put a boundary around that okay so actually say no to that behavior no to allowing that behavior to take your ease from you okay so it's really really important that we know that when we apply a boundary um, that it doesn't always make us feel better it can actually make us feel quite uncomfortable because we can be moving into an area that actually doesn't align with our values you know so for instance if we're a very empathetic person but we're in a relationship that can mentally or emotionally drain us and we have to start saying no to that relationship then that really is cutting off that empathy to that person but actually turning that empathy back on ourselves so be aware that when you do apply a boundary that you can feel guilty and it's normal to feel guilty. So what can you say to yourself? You know, I choose to be empathetic to myself. I choose to be kind to myself. So looking at those values, you could have love, trust, honesty, a whole load of things and say, well, how am I showing up for myself in this scenario? So I know this person can't give me those. I've communicated with that person. So I need to respect myself. So I need to distance myself. I need to change the dynamic of the relationship. Often we can't cut the people out of our lives because it can be family or colleagues or whatever it is but we can shift the dynamic of the relationship by you know stopping giving our power over to them and really seeing the relationship for what it is well that person has a different set of values to me i'm actually going to shift my perception around this relationship i'm going to shift my expectations around this relationship and how can i show up for myself how can i say yes to myself and no to that behavior that brings me out of my state of ease, my state of peace, my state of happiness, whatever it is. So I just want you to think about that and realize Putting boundaries in place is so crucial to our well-being, but it can be uncomfortable. So get comfortable with being uncomfortable and know the value of saying yes to yourself, yes to your well-being, and no to people, things or situations that do not align with your values and do not serve you. Have a great day. Bye.